it is time for one of our favorite times of the month here at KOCO. You know we love celebrating and honoring our educators, and we want to show them how much we appreciate them. Yes, KOCO and Quail Creek Bank, they want to highlight the amazing teachers right here in the metro. And Cameron Seibert, you are at Midwest City Middle School about to surprise our March Teacher of the Month. Oh, I'm so excited. Take it away. It is absolutely an exciting morning, guys. Just behind these walls, the gymnasium here, we've got a big surprise for you. are not going to wait any longer. We're going to go ahead and come right inside the gymnasium. A couple students that are in here, and I'm sure we're going to get some noise here. Here at Midwest City Middle School, a special seventh grade teacher that's here, Miss Holly Johnson. You can hear the excitement. Miss Johnson. Hello, I'm Cameron with KOCO. Happy to be the first to congratulate you. You are our March Teacher of the Month on KOCO. Clearly your students appreciate you. Are you surprised, first of all? Yes, very. <laughs> I had no idea what was going on. We weren't expecting this. Yeah. People here really appreciate the work that you're doing. First and foremost, why do you do what you do? Why did you become a teacher? Um, I became a teacher because it's my calling, and my calling is to make sure that every kid knows that they have someone that loves them and is in their corner. There's track students here. I heard there was a track meet yesterday mm -hmm. and that you might not have came into school today, but principal at Texas, you said we needed you to come in today. Yeah. Just goes to show that you're a team player. You're willing to still come in and be here at work. Mm -hmm. What is it that makes you so dedicated to your job? Um, I love my job. I love my kids. I love my coworkers. I love my administration team. Um, it's just, it's nice to come to work. It's, it's the best place that I've taught. I really enjoy it. Not only do you show up and teach and devote yourself to, to educating the next generation, but you go the extra mile. I understand you've done Facebook drives to help get extra supplies for students, making sure that everybody has an equal chance to be on equal playing field. Why do that? Um, I just know that some of my students don't have what they need to be successful, um, as, as successful as they can be. And so I want to do everything that I can do to make that happen and give everyone what they need so they can be successful. Another way you're going the extra mile, not just a teacher, but also a track coach. Tell me about that. What made you want to be a track coach? Um, well, I grew up in track and went to college for track, and it was, I mean, it helped me in so many ways and taught me not only the sport, but also responsibility, how to work as a team, um, like how to encourage each other. And so that's something that I want to instill in my students and also give them an extra reason to stay on top of their schoolwork and give them a reason to come to school because some of a lot of our kids, you know, don't necessarily want to come to school, but sports help them stay. And so that's something that I want to be a part of. Clearly your students appreciate you. What do you guys think? Does Ms. Johnson deserve Teacher of the Month this month or what? And Ms. Johnson, that's not all. We also have a very special surprise for you over here. Our partnership with Quail Creek Bank. You're being awarded $1,000 for being our Teacher of the Month this month. I can see the emotion on your face. Why? What, what's going through your mind right now? Um, this, <laughs> I'm just really surprised. <laughs> um, uh, didn't expect it, but also just so thankful. Um, and, you know, just, I, yeah, just so thankful. What do, you, what do you think some of this money might go towards? Um, well, um, <laughs> definitely things for the classroom because, and, you know, right now, I, yeah, that's, that's all I, I Lost mean, for words. Yep. <laughs> I totally understand. <laughs> yep. You're, am I right that you're in your first year or you're just, just no. getting to Midwest City, though? Yes, at first Midwest year City. in Midwest City. Mm -hmm. What a great start. Yeah. I wish you the best moving forward. Thank you so much for all that you do for the kids. Is there anything else Thank I didn't you. ask you that you think you want to say? Nope. <laughs> <laughs> what do you guys think? One more time. <laughs> there you have it, guys. Congratulations to Ms. Johnson, our Teacher of the Month for March. This should let you know that you should absolutely go onto the KOCO website, nominate someone to be the next month Teacher of the Month. Clearly, it's appreciated here in Midwest City.